Hello guys. Today, today I've, today, we're doing a Diary of Ruby Kid video, but I'm sorry I haven't been posting because my, my, I'm in sick, so, um, yeah, I'm still sick now, but I just wanted to do this. Shit to my house yesterday. This book looks really cool. <coughs> um. So yeah. There, here, here, here. Like we got all the cool books. Oh my god. Guys, what's your favorite Wimpy Kid book? What is it? Be serious. What is it? Mine is probably, I think, Roderick Rules or Big. No, no. Roderick Rules or The Deep End. Those, I think, are my favorites. Okay, I'm gonna get more to review because our last review video was a year ago and I haven't finished all the books yet. Because I, I, I finished all of them except I haven't read a page of Diaper Overload yet. But, ah, uh, these. I, uh, yeah, I did all of these. Let's see. Last review video. I didn't do Big Shot, but I just, I, I finished Big Shot a year ago, so, yeah, it was a good book, I really like it, it's kind of funny, I like how, like, I like the thing about this book, it's like, like, at the underdogs at the end, or something at the end, didn't, like, Greg keep losing, and then he scored the winning shot, or something, Yeah, he won. Oh, yeah, right here. Oh, no. Dogs. What does it say? Every dog has to say. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there. That was a good part. So. Okay. Now. Oh, yeah, I also read the, the Rowley books. I read the Rowley books. Yeah, but like, they weren't as good. Well, this one, I like this one. I like the first one. I got this at my school's book fair, and I thought it was really cool. I liked it a lot. So, here's gonna be the pile for like the Rowley books. And this, this one, it's kind of weird. Yeah, I was like, this one weird. And this one I got a year ago apparently came out. And I read literally all of it on my MCAS. My MCAS thingy after I did my MCAS. My teacher would let us read after we did MCAS. So, yeah. That was MCAS last year. I finished that book. Now, now we've got one of my favorites, The Deep End. Well, yeah, The Deep End was really cool. Oh wait, I forgot, what was it, what was it, what was it called? <gasps> the Getaway, 
the getaway that's also one of my big favorite that's that my that the getaway might be my favorite it's really good i love it it's a super good book oh i love this part the skunk i love the skunk part the skunk part that's so funny okay so yeah Kid wrecking ball. Oh, I love the part where he breaks the house. It's funny. I also have like the um, I also have the part. I know. I also have the book that's like the do-it-yourself book. Yeah, I have that book. I don't have any of the movie ones. I don't have any of the movie ones. I was just like, I already watched them all. <laughs> oh, yeah, and guys, new Roderick Rules animated movie is coming out December 3rd, so get ready. I'm going to buy it. I bought the regular one the day it came out. I watched it like five times. I'm gonna do the same for Roger Rules. Go watch the trailer if you haven't. It looks so good. <laughs> Meltdown. Meltdown. The Meltdown. Ice Age. Is this Ice Age the Meltdown? <laughs> I don't know what to say about this one. I remember, yeah, I remember. It's just that they like get into a big snowball fight or something. And it's crazy or something. Yeah, it's just not like. Yeah. There's not much to say. They build a bunch of forts. They like do cool battles, I guess. Oh, now, 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 now it's time for getting away. <laughs> for the getaway. Over two and three. I can't believe all these books have like, I can't believe already. Already, Diaper Overload has 275 million books sold. That's over. Oh my god, how much are these books? These are like $18. Jeff Kenny is rich. <laughs> um, so yeah, I love this part. There's so much to say. I like the plane ride and stuff. I like the weird spider part. I like... I like... It's just so amazing. I just... It's cool. Roger gets a girlfriend for like a part. And I love the monkey part. Oh god. Oh. Okay. Yeah, remember? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um. Also, Manny saves the day at the end. Where's the monkey? Where's the monkey? Where's the monkey? Monkey? Monk? Monk? Mink? Monk? Monk? Mink? Monk? Monkey? Mink? I'm gonna find the monkey part, but that's one of my favorite parts. Okay. Oh, double dying. Oh, I got soft cover books? I only got it on cover. Oh, that's sad. Okay, um, so I got. This is soft cover. I don't like the soft cover. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't really like this one. <gasps> oh, here we are. Old school. I 
I like the lemon part when Rowley like s like squirts the lemon in his eye. I like to chase in the woods. I did a whole diary of what we could play that I don't want to talk about. Oh my god. <laughs> so I did this summer camp that I hated. And it was on Diary of a Wimpy Kid. It was like a play that we had to practice every day for like eight hours. And we didn't get any like lunch or snack time. And I was like, they kill me. <laughs> started at like, started at nine. Went till four. But four. Yeah, it's eight hours. Why does this happen? <laughs> My school is so cool. It's six hours, but it's still really nice. You don't practice for something all day in my school. Not my camp. My camp is so bad. I hate it. It tortured me. And I was, I was Greg, but, like, still, I was Greg, but, like, I didn't like it. I was like, it's a guy, guy, guy. They had the stupidest, most stupid songs in the whole entire world. If you want to watch the play with me in it, go to, like, oh my god. Search up Oliver, and then there's going to be, like, a profile picture of, like, a place I don't even know. And then click on that place. He doesn't have that much subscribers. Click on it, and then you'll find the Diary of a Wimpy Kid play. It is so bad. It's like 40 minutes long, but it's so bad. It's so bad. I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh my god. My dog's barking. Um, I didn't like that. That was torture. When did the long haul get knocked over? Oh my god. A bunny rabbit. You little bunny foo foo. Oh my god. <laughs> um, the long haul. Oh, this was another good one. I like the pig part. Oh, I like the seagull and the um, the um, Cheerio part or whatever. He feeds them like cheese puffs or something. I love this part. Cheese puffs, seagulls. I like the part when Manny speaks Spanish to guys and makes them go back to the thing. <laughs> Get the pig back. Mm. Oh my god, Brad, I'm so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. I got a stack over here, guys. Look at this stack. Look at this beautiful stack of whippy kids. Yeah, oh my god. Hard luck. I like the eight ball, eight ball, eight ball, eight ball, eight ball, eight ball. And if you're wondering what plays the book on, every single book combined it in one to make a play. <laughs> it's just, I hate it. <laughs> I think I might kill myself. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get. The third wheel, and then cabin sneakers gonna fall. Ha! Knew it. Okay. The third wheel. <laughs> oh, oh. Why did that make such a loud noise? Why did that make such a loud noise, bro? I was like, oh my 
god. Why is that not good? Dude, we always think it gets a date. We always get a date when Rowley steals it. Something. Oh no, Rowley gets a date. Then Greg tries to steal it. And yeah, <laughs> I don't even know. weird. I like the Christmas time and stuff, but I didn't like Manny's creepy doll. Like, what, what was that? Oh my god. Manny's creepy doll is so weird. So that book, all of them are good so far, except I didn't really like Double Down. There's still more to go. But The Ugly Truth. <laughs> Okay, um, so yeah, this book, it's about, like, the egg project. Everyone knows about the egg project. Okay, um, um, and yeah, so... and read it then my mom would have my dog in the car because he had to go to the dog cleaner or something and I would be reading my dog days and I'd be like bear dog days <laughs> and this is the one where they do get the dog right yeah they get the dog uh -huh. this is good this is a good book yeah yeah, okay, cool. Oh my god, I'm not getting a fat stack of wimpy kids. This is the last straw. You hear me? You hear me? You hear me? Do you hear me? Okay. The last straw. <laughs> oh god. Why is this? <laughs> so yeah. Um. Oh, now for another one of my faves, Roderick. <laughs> He's like Greg die. <laughs> like that, and yeah. This <laughs> book. All the books are so weird. All the books are so weird. All the books are so weird. <laughs> They're all funny. But, like, some weren't, like, as funny as I expected. Because, <laughs> like, some are really funny and some are not. <laughs> and we got the last but definitely not least. Maybe the best. <laughs> Diary of a Wimpy Kid? Nothing. <laughs> Diary of a Wimpy Kid. <clears throat> Diary of a Wimpy Kid? Nothing. <laughs> but yeah, it's Greg. Yeah, it introduces you to everyone. It's also very hilarious. I remember my mom buying this from the bookstore, surprising me all through text. I was like, hey, mom, where are you? I was just home from school on the bus, and she's not really here. And I told her that I wanted a Diary of Wimpy Kid, and she was just like, she texted me a picture of um, Diary of Wimpy Kid and Diary of Wimpy Kid Project Rules. And then I was like, I was freaking out over text. I was like... Oh yeah, and also, also, what 
one time. She bought me this one in eleven, so we can get a bunch. But she had to like sell um the first two. Wait, what? She had to like sell the first two. Where are the first two at? Right here. The, oh yeah, first two, first two, first two. She had to sell because we already got them. Yeah, this is a big box. Big box. And yeah. Okay, 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 okay. And yeah. Now it's the review video. Now, how am I going to carry all these books? They're like, weigh a ton. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, I can make a book. A diary of a wimpy kid book. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. Now it's the worst time of this whole video. Putting them back on the shelf, okay? You go back on the shelf. Go back on the shelf. The last straw goes back on the shelf. Dog days goes back on the shelf. Ugly truth goes back on the shelf. Oh my god, you know how many people got out of it. Having beaver goes on the shelf. Oh my god. The third wheel goes on the shelf. Hard luck goes on the shelf. Oh my god. The long haul goes And last but not least, Big Shot goes on the shelf. You might be wondering, why does Diaper Overload not go on the shelf? Because I haven't read it yet. This is the shelf of all the books I read. Ooh, 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 ha. And Rowley goes back on the shelf, okay? Rowley... Awesome friendly diary goes back on the shelf. Um, awesome friendly adventure goes back on the shelf. And then last, Spooky Stories goes back on the shelf. That's what I always used to do. Yeah. You're next, little buddy. I'm going to read you and then I'm going to put you on the shelf, okay? And you're like, <laughs> so yeah, you look pretty good as a book. Mr. Diaper Overload. My diaper. Diaper Overload. So, yeah. Go read this book. Go get it at your Barnes and Noble near you or something. Buy it. Whatever bookstore. Every bookstore near you probably has it because it's done. We have a web yet. Um, maybe go to Amazon Books or something. Get it. I don't even know. Just order it. Order it off for Amazon. Order it off on Amazon. Gets here in a day. Gets here in a day. Gets here in two days. One day. Okay, just order it. Okay, bye.
But I have to say bye now, guys. Have a nice day. Have a nice rest of your day. And bye. I'll see you later.